I feel like flipped it in a double. Party it out with half, feel like flipped it in a double. <laughs> What's good YouTube? Welcome back to the channel, Jacob Alava. And today, gym tayo tayo kasama natin si Greg Lifts and Von Campos and Jen Lifts. So, collab vlog siya. Actually, si Von siya kasi Grant. Online friends na kami. Kasi these guys, sumasampa sila sa natural bodybuilding. It's nice to collab with them. Uh, marami kayo matututunan for sure. And chill kwentuhan lang kasi first time ko sila mamimit. Let's go! Fit check at LA Joggers, 90 per release and under armor shoes. What's up guys? So we're here in Iron Supply. Last few days nya. Sama natin si Master Grant, Vaughn Campos, and Jen Lift. We're gonna be hitting an upper body day. Inom din kami mamaya. Bigyan ko kayo ng tour sa gym ni Grant bago magsara. Let's go. We have Mr. Von Campos. He has a YouTube channel. Follow nyo. Sobrang ganda ng content niya. To be honest, one of my favorite content creators na fitness dito sa Philippines because he's funny and minsan lang naman may funny content creator. So head over his channel. Subscribe kayo. We also have Mr. Grant Tang. What's up, sirs? WNBF Bodybuilding Pro. I look up to Grant because I learn a lot from him. Lalo na pag nagpapa Q&A siya. If you want intermediate to advanced level na bodybuilding or physique, information. I always ask him or I always watch his stuff. So today, mag upper body workout tayo. Let's go. First workout natin, machine chest press. You get to move each side freely. Kalaw fixture. This can help you really target your chest. Eh. So ako ginagawa ko, pack my back, chest out, para mo feel mo talaga sa pecs. One of the things na nakikita ko sa ibang tao, pag pinagawa nila yung ganitong movement, nakaganyan sila. Medyo hindi mo talaga mag-feel chest mo dyan. So you want to drive your back, arch, plant feet. Chest out, press. Slow and control, press. Fairly common mistakes you see when you're using a machine to do a chest press. Your feet. So you'll notice a lot of people when they do a chest press, either masyadong mataas yung seat, basta alanganin yan. Pakita ko parang gumagaling yung paan nila. So there's no stability there. So if you want to fix that, either you use something like this, uh, may platform ka dyan, something to step on, get some stability in your press. Second issue that I usually see with people on a machine is um, hindi naka-stack yung joints nila. So, you want your forearms in particular to be parallel to the movement of the machine or the resistance. Since this machine goes here, so susunod din dun yung forearm mo. So when you're gonna press, press this way. You wanna avoid being all the way up here. Since the movement is going this way, if you're pushing this way, medyo alanganin siya. Okay? Um, that's not really gonna hit your chest as well as you would if you were somewhere down, deeper down here. You also don't want to be pushing this way because it's siyempre medyo, it doesn't look right. Guys, si Von, actually, kaka-compete lang yung last year, no? Yeah. So you were heavy. Heavy. Ilang, umabot kang 200? Parang 190-something. 196 at mga 510, no? 510. Pakita ko sa inyo yung transformation niya. And that was his first show. Yeah. Some of you guys want to do natural bodybuilding. Let's take it from the guys na may experience. Kasi ako personally, never pa ako nag-compete. And maybe, sa future, who knows? Medyo matinding commitment. So guys, we talked to Grant about nutrition because he's a coach as well. Actually, he coaches people to be stage ready. Si Vod and si Jen, the cameraman right now. Salamat, Jen. He coached them. When we talk about nutrition, kasi it's actually quite simple. People usually overcomplicate. Calories in, calories out. Then they ask, what is food? I mean, calories in, calories out. That's, that's the bulk of it, na, I think. Na parang, once you've got that down, everything else sort of follows. That's true. There's nothing else to do. Even if like, your, your food selection, 
macros mo. And I feel like maraming tao, they don't really give it time. For example, maintenance calories ko, paano ko malalaman? You have to give it some time, eh? two weeks of trying out the calories. Kasi doon mo malalaman if it changes. Eh? Yeah, I get a lot of it in the Q&A na parang, how do I know my maintenance calories? What's the best way to calculate which formula is the best and which one is the most accurate? And in the yeah, end of the day, the best way to do it is to just use whatever formula you want. Most people kasi wala patience. Eh. Yeah. They think na dapat yung first two weeks ko may results na ako. Dapat ngayon first two weeks yung tinitimpla niyo pa lang yung calories niyo eh. Kaya maganda hanapin yung maintenance niyo more than the de- the sure deficit or the sure gain kasi from the maintenance you can adjust it. Eh. For example, you just tried out sure deficit na calories. Hindi mo alam kung how much yung deficit mo eh. Naka 300 deficit ka ba? Naka 500 ka? Diba? For most people that na na-encounter ko, usually ang laki ng deficit eh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because I want results now. So the bigger the deficit, the faster the results. And this is good. Actually, kahit 300 calorie deficit, tapos your macros are on point. Pweding week per week, fat lang talaga matatanggal sa katawan. So guys, itong machine na to, this is actually one of the most solid back machines. Yung pag may issue ka sa row, pag barbell row, nangihina yung lower back. Though this takes it away. Ano, paano hand place nyo dito ko? Kasi dalawa yung handles nyo dito. More on dito sa taas, mas sa upper back siya, so more on your traps and rhomboids. Dito, upper back and rhomboids? Oo. Oh. Oo oh, nga, nafe-feel ko nga siya. Oh. Tapos may eliminate niya rin kasi di ba pagka nandun ka like yung hammer strength uh, row thing sa chest supported sa mga commercial gyms. Di ba kasi nakikita natin di ba gym jerk lang siya? Oo. Oh. So parang pag dyan, mga humble ka, may eliminate yung... Uh, pag stable ka sa hawak, no? Mm. Parang it's all you eh. Solid. Mas mararamdaman mo siya talaga. Then yung sa isang grip naman. Yeah. Uh, more on... More sa, lats. Oh, more on... May onting lats siya, pero medyo dun pa rin sa muscle group na yun. Upper back. May, may onting lats. Waking up and no. Wasting time is all I do. Okay, we're gonna move on to what I would consider my favorite lat focus workout. So this is gonna be a modified single arm hammer strength high row. Okay, so we're using free handles here. What they're gonna do is you'll have one arm to brace against this pad. Yeah, so you can brace it like this or you can brace it over, whichever whichever you're more comfortable. Um, I would move a bit back because it's medyo mahaba yan to. Um, I would actually have one leg down, pulling side, put it down here. Yeah, that way you have a bit more room to engage your lats. So for this, we're going to do more of a neutral grip. We're going to have straps So we're going to limit our forearms and our biceps from taking over. Okay. So when we pull here, so you want to drop your shoulders, keep them low. Try to avoid letting your shoulders climb as you go up. So mm-hmm. Just keep it here. So I'll keep my shoulders to yes. a certain level. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah, because I can see it can go here. Yeah. So drop your shoulders. You want to scoot a bit out to this side. Just a little bit. So now the pull is aligned with this lat and go. There oh go. yeah. Yeah. I feel it. So for this you don't really have to think about, you know, how when they when they say parang you have to stretch it all the way yeah. out. That's not really the case, especially for your lats. Um, once it stretches out to a certain degree, pag lumampas na dun, parang napupunta na siya to other parts of your back. So it's uh, one direct flow. Yeah. Na it, you wouldn't think na it would engage this much for such a little movement. Yeah, 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 yeah. You want to imagine bringing your elbow towards your hip. Uh, you don't have to bring your arm all the way back. Just keep your elbow tight and then just stick it here towards Doing lateral raises with dumbbells, uh, look characteristic of this dumbbell lateral raise. Dito siya pinaka mahirap sa taas, di ba? Pero dito lang siyang loob. Yeah. Madali siya. So sa it taba. loses tension. Yeah, it, it, it loses like most, actually it becomes zero yeah. there. It, it starts it, here. This is this is your full 20 pounds and it goes down to yeah. zero. Yeah, so we're gonna try to address this by adding some cable resistance. So when we're using cables naman, uh, medyo balik na siya. So yung peak. Na ano na peak ng resistance would be around here. Um, versus when you're here, medyo bumabawa siya. Okay, so more here, a little bit less here. So what we're gonna do is put these two together. Um, gagawin natin medyo mas even yung distribution ng resistance. That's how we do it when we add a dumbbell. And here, okay? There's tension on Yes, the yes. So the resistance profile here, mas balance siya. Okay, so okay. Okay. bring it around here to the... There we go. No, no, you're... you're 
Sorry, there you go. Just upright lang yung... There you go. Medyo yeah. like a front raise. Want this to lie Said you want it honest so guys, triceps. So Grant's gonna show us how he does his triceps at the table. So baka pwede nila itong i-try kung meron ka. Ooh. You know? Ooh, okay. <laughs> push <laughs> down. Cross push downs. Yeah. <laughs> so what you wanna do here, you don't really need to use these. These are called yoga straps, climbing straps, uh, daisy chains. Hindi naman kailangan. You can just go straight to the handles pero mas convenient lang talaga to. We're also using cuffs here. Tapos gagamitin mo lang. You're gonna use the outside of your hand. You don't have to go. You don't. You don't have to use your entire uh, your wrist. Because it's medyo the shot. So just just keep uh, the outside of your hand. Tap. Keep your thumb out. Then. Alright. Okay. Bend down. Flare out your elbows a little bit. Drop your shoulders. Engage the push down. The going in triceps. Okay. It's not. You're not gonna move your upper arm around. Mm -hmm. Na parang. Lock uh, Yeah. Keep keep that upper arm in one spot. Tapos hindi yun dapat umang at your shoulders mo. Don't don't let it shrug. Just just leave it leave it down there. Ganda ng joggers mo. Oh, I I <laughs> Physique check tayo kay Coach Grant kasi he's a prep coach. Gusto ko marinig yung mga constructive criticisms niya kasi that's how we improve it. Hindi ka naman mag improve kung sa tingin mo, ah, okay na to. Kasi when you see it by yourself, di ba? May subjective opinion ka. It's nice to have another person to see. Weird guy. It gets leaner here. Parang siya. No, just do the front. Yeah. This is this is the one he was saying was your smaller side. Yeah. The, the leaner side. Yeah. Yeah. Kita eh, diba? Yeah. Because the abs are pagano. Yeah. The abs are the abs are more. Because this side. one is lower. Yeah. Chaka mas lumalabas mm. siya from the side. This one is the thicker this side. Is the, yeah, this is the but if it side. gets leaner, it's probably the nicer side. Yeah. I feel like sa akin. Fitness. Yeah, I would say. I mean, your your chest isn't lagging. Mm. Um, maybe some more upper, pero yeah, not by a lot. Your arms could use more sides. Magana ako just click a bicep or something. Yeah, could use a bit more lats too. Pero yeah, fitness is genuine. Let's let's hit your back pose. How far is that? Just a relaxed or whatever. Yeah. Give me a back flex. Okay. Bicep? Bicep. Mm. Okay. Fitness. Fitness. Some more lats. Like the, the lower side of your lats. Yeah. Where it's going to hit. Yeah. 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 The rest need a little bit more. Okay. Yung thickness mo, parang yan, no? kaya pa konti sa traps. Sa akin medyo man. Parang lahat tayo ganun eh. Kulang yan. Hindi kulang traps eh. Okay. <laughs> not, not, from, not from shrugs or anything. Just, just like more rows. Yeah. Yan eh. Actually, rhomboids especially. Yeah. Yeah. 
the width is there, but most of it's along the you know, soteries. But you can you can you can get a little bit, yeah. Then sa then sa lower that, yeah. Inside, you can definitely get that a little bit bigger. That's me too. You you scoop your right with your bicep. Right scoop titty. Your right titty. Your back tip. And then scoop it. Hands. Like uh, just just imagine doing this first. Yeah. And then hands here, and then imagine doing a row. Because it's more your arms, so you want to close it for less space. Yep. And then don't flex your left back. Just flex your right. And then try to try to stretch your left back. Yeah. Baba mo yung left dad. Baba mo muna. Tapos. Yeah. Because na na kagani to ko tutu muna ka. So baba mo siya. No. Huwag kang maglagay ng hindutas. Yeah. There you go. Tilt a bit more. To the front. Ay, just your upper torso. Your waist should still fix it. Pull. And then this one. Pull. You also try it like a vacuum. And then pull. Para mas maliit yung yeah. waist. Pula. Yan. 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 Um, this leg, like, dikit pa pa. And then just bend down. You know? Yeah. Here you go. Parang wala nang bewa. Oh, shit. Oh! Fine, say.